My name is Sophie Roberts, and I'm a graduate of the 2020 Spring UCLA Grow LA Victory Garden class. My family has had small gardens all my life, but before this class, I didn't really know what it takes to grow something from seed to fruit. I was able to put these skills to the test this summer when I worked on an organic farm in Washington and got to truly see what it's like to be a farmer. One aspect of gardening that incorporated into their life is composting. This is a process that transforms food scraps and yard waste into nutrient-rich soil. Although there are many ways to keep a compost, my family uses a wood structure in our yard. There are two components to compost material. Green waste, which includes things like grass clippings or food scraps, not including meat or dairy. And then there's the brown waste, which would be things like leaves or compostable paper. With a roughly equal amount of each, the organic material is decomposed by bacteria, yeast, and fungi, and turns into an amendment material for gardens, which in turn helps plants to grow healthy and strong. Hot composting can work as fast as two weeks and requires turning the pile every day, while cold composting can take as long as three months, but requires less maintenance of about every three weeks. Agitating the pile in this way helps to balance the carbon to nitrogen ratio and will eventually provide quality soil. What's so great about composting is that it's a regenerative process, so the food that grows from this round may contribute to the contents of the next cycle. Even if you don't have a garden, it's important to compost when you can so that your food waste doesn't emit methane in a landfill. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you were able to learn something new.